Hi right, folks, welcome back to the channel. You see I got the orange on today. Uh, I'm coming down in here where, where I ended up shooting that hog out out in the marsh with my longbow. I'm gonna come check this area, see if they still using it, which they should be, because there's less food now than there was then. And if these the private landowners on the other side of the marsh are still putting out corn on, in the feeders, I'm gonna try to catch them coming off of the public, going over to the private, like I like I was doing then. Uh, it's really hot today. So that's another reason why I wanted to get down here to this marsh. Banking on them trying to use the marsh to keep cool. There's already some out here. The only bad thing is I got a bad wind for where they at. They look like some smaller hogs. Let me try to get up on this bank over here. Get out of the, because it's, it's blowing up towards the mainland at the moment, but it keeps shifting. I'm scared they're gonna come out from behind that tall grass there and they're gonna see me. It'll shoot further than that, but the closer the better. Yeah, there's another one out in front of me right here. I'm glad I didn't get up. That one would end up busting me. that one gets over there I'm gonna try to make a move. The good thing is it's well on this side of the point. Nothing on that other side is gonna get blowed out if I screw this up. The more likely they're gonna run to the private land over there. I need that last one's about to catch up. As soon as he does I start easing over that way.
think I had the camera on. I thought I was recording. See that? That patch of grass right there? That was about 15 yards on the back side of it. And one come out from behind it. You know, and I stopped and stood here, and it went back to feeding. And I made one little move, and it looked up, and it took off. And then one by one, they just kept going. Well, that was close. It's always nice to get out here and get on them. I said, when I walked out here, when I spotted them, I made the wrong move by going up to the, I went up to the mainland and tried to close the distance. I should have watched them a little bit longer to see what they were actually doing. Because if I'd have stayed out here where I originally was walking at, they'd have come right to me. I heard that feeder grow off over there, so that's a good thing. We can hang out here this afternoon. But I'm already soaking wet from sweating. That'd have been some perfect little eaters. What I'm gonna do is walk around this point right here and look, see if there's any more out in the marsh. One big old coon over there. I know this done got extremely hot. These hogs just gotta come out here. I'm not seeing a whole lot of sun. They may have moved to move to a totally different area. But it was I want to say it was this time last year. They was in somewhat of this area. They wasn't far from here. I mean, I'm seeing some sign, but it ain't like it was last time I was out here. And obviously we seen those 10 back there. I think, I think that private owner over there has been working on these hogs. Because I'm pretty sure those little ones I just tried to stalk was part of the one that I killed with my bow was out of that group. And there was quite a few big ones with it. So I'm going to go on a limb and say... That corn feeder over there is putting a hurting on these hogs. We got about 30 minutes till sunset. So we got roughly an hour. Guess I need to go back around that corner. Figure out where I want to set up at and sit for the rest of the afternoon. I'm headed back up to the car. I done drink all my daggone water. I need to go get some more. And by the time I walk up to the car, it's going to be too late to go anywhere else. But I do have, I have a few more spots that's marshy like I was just in. That I'll check over the next few times I'm able to get out here in the woods. But I just don't know when that's going to be. Um, you know, now this weekend is going to be a little busy. Don't know if I'm gonna make it out in the woods or not. But anyhow, it's a good day in the woods. I appreciate every, each and every one of y'all that's subscribed to the channel and follows along. Y'all stay tuned, we'll catch you on the next video.